by the shores of Silver Lake. Chapter 31 Mosquitoes We must build the stable for the horses, Paul said. It won't always be warm enough for them to stay outdoors, and a bad storm might come, even in summer. They must have shelter. Alan too, Paul? Laura asked. Cattle are better off outdoors in the summer, Paul told her, but I like to have horses in a stable at night. Laura held boards for Paul. She handed him tools and brought nails when he built the stable. At the west of the house, against the little hill, it would be sheltered there on the west and to the, and the north, where the cold wind, winter winds were blowing. The days were warm. Mosquitoes came out of the big slough at sundown and sang their high, keen song all night as they swarmed around Ellen, biting her and sucking the blood till she ran around and around on her picket rope. They were into the stable and bit the horses till they pulled at their halters and stamped. They came into the claim shanty and bit everyone there until great blotches raised their on faces and hands. Their singing and sting of their bites made night a torment. This will never do, Paul said. We must have mosquito bar on the windows and door. It's the big slough, Ma complained. The mosquitoes come from there. I wish we were further away from it. But Paul liked the big slough. There are acres and acres of hay there that anyone can have for the, for the cutting, he told Ma. No one will ever take up homesteads in the big slough. There is only uplay, uh, upland hay on our place, but with the big slough so near, we can always cut hay there and have all we need. Besides, all the prairie grass is full of mosquitoes too. I'll go to town today and get some mosquito bar. Paul bought yards of pink mosquito bar from town and strips of lumber to make a frame for the screen door. When he got when he made the door, Ma tacked mosquito bar over the windows, then she tacked it to the door frame, and Pa hung the mosquito door. That night he built a smudge of old damp grass so the smoke would drift before the stable door. Mosquitoes would not go through the smoke. Pa made another smudge so Alan could stay in its smoke, and she went at once and stayed there. Pa made sure there was no dry grass near the smudges and built them up so they would last all night. There, he said, I guess that fixes the mosquitoes.